Once upon a time, in a world not quite like our own, lived a curious and imaginative girl named Alice. One sunny afternoon, while she daydreamed by the riverbank, a peculiar white rabbit rushed past her, muttering about being late. Intrigued, Alice decided to follow him down a rabbit hole that seemed to stretch deep into the earth. As she tumbled down the rabbit hole, the world around Alice transformed into a kaleidoscope of colors and strange landscapes. She found herself in Wonderland, a place where logic and reality seemed to bend and twist like the Cheshire Cat's mischievous grin. Alice encountered a series of eccentric characters, each more peculiar than the last. The grinning Cheshire Cat, who appeared and disappeared at will, offered cryptic advice. The Mad Hatter and the March Hare hosted a never-ending tea party, where time itself seemed to have lost its way. The Queen of Hearts, with her love for painting roses red and her penchant for shouting off with their heads, ruled over Wonderland with a tyrannical flair. Throughout her adventures, Alice's size changed unpredictably. One moment she was too small to reach a doorknob, and the next she was too tall to fit through a tiny door. The Caterpillar, perched atop a mushroom, offered her advice on growing and shrinking, leaving Alice more bewildered than before. In her quest to make sense of Wonderland, Alice discovered that the key to navigating this topsy-turvy world was not to make sense of it at all. Embracing the absurdity and unpredictability became her guiding principle. As she journeyed through Wonderland, Alice encountered challenges that tested her courage and wit. The Queen of Hearts demanded a croquet match using flamingos and hedgehogs, and the Mock Turtle shared his melancholy tales of soup-making and underwater adventures. Eventually, Alice found herself at a trial where she was accused of stealing the Queen's tarts. Just as the Queen shouted off with her head, Alice realized that Wonderland was a dream, and she had the power to wake up whenever she pleased. With a determined spirit, she declared, you're nothing but a pack of cards, and woke up back by the riverbank. As Alice opened her eyes, she marveled at the ordinary world around her. Although Wonderland was just a dream, its lessons stayed with her. She embraced her curiosity and learned that sometimes, the most extraordinary adventures can happen when you let go of the need for everything to make sense. And so, with the lessons of Wonderland in her heart, Alice returned home, forever changed by the enchanting and nonsensical journey that took her to a world beyond imagination.